about your horror film that this is going to be in Marathi also and Hindi also? Uh, it's going to be a Marathi film with obviously English uh, with obviously English subtitles. It's called Bali. So L is a very typical Marathi uh, alphabet. In Hindi, it means Bali. जैसे हम बलि चढ़ाते हैं या हम कहते हैं कि उसकी बेवजह उसकी बलि चढ़ गई यार सो इन दिस कॉन्टेक्स्ट इट मीन्स द विक्टम इट्स अ हॉरर फिल्म इट्स अ क्लासिक हॉरर फिल्म एंड इट्स अ मराठी फिल्म बट आई फील आई फील दैट इन लास्ट फाइव इयर्स और सो एंड आई डोंट थिंक आई बी ओवर स्टेटिंग इट इफ आई से इट दैट द लाइन्स बिटवीन लिंग्विस्टिक सिनेमा आर ब्लरिंग एंड अ लॉट ऑफ नॉन बेंगोली पीपल आर कंज्यूमिंग बेंगोली कॉन्टेंट a lot of uh, non south films are consuming south content uh, similarly a lot of non maharashtrians are consuming marathi cinema and uh, i can very very proudly say that uh, we make uh, some of the finest films in the country and we make f- some of the finest content in the country so in that league in the last 5 years we have consistently as an industry generated a non marathi audience to our marathi cinema and keeping that tradition i think bali will really really hook you uh, it will scare you it's a classic horror film but since i am more of a romantic hero and more of a romcom kind of a guy we also wanted to uh, you know uh, give those fans their money's worth so so bali is uh, is a horror film with a lot of uh, family values to it in terms of um, there's a lot of emotion to it it's a father son story so I, at at the base of it it's a very emotional film it's a very um, it's a very sensitive film and obviously it's got uh, horror as the backdrop so it's a lot of fun You know, apart from this film, what are the other projects that you are doing and that are going to release? So I heard like you are doing music videos also. So if you could leave. Ah, uh, yeah. I'm, I'll I'll not be singing. Uh, thank God to the audiences for that. But yeah, I'll be working in a music video very very soon, and I think it should be. I should be ready to talk about it in about a month's time. I'm I'm shooting it with. Uh, so I had done this contest in Maharashtra called the Dream Girl Contest, and uh, we had asked, uh, and we got more than six thousand uh, girls who auditioned for it, and and we've shortlisted ten girls, and we'll be uh, doing a music video with me and those ten girls, and uh, hopefully. if if the covid thing and all uh, uh, recovers and all so we'll hopefully be shooting that sometime in uh, the next 20 days or 25 days and hopefully should release in the, in the next one month time so yes working on that apart from that uh, i did a very very uh, quirky and very very um, a thriller kind of a web show last year called samantar which released on mx player and which uh, uh, apparently did very very well about 150 million plus downloads across the country Uh, one of the most watched one of the most viewed web contents last year so we are coming out with the season 2 of that content and uh, samantar 2 will come sometime around last week of april or first half of may and i'm also very excited for that uh, and uh, so so there's bali there's samantar and there's this music thing i was doing and apart from that i've started my own little company uh, and uh, on the 13th of april on the auspicious occasion of gudi padwa me and my four partners will launch it it's called atmasanman.in so it's a women entrepreneur uh, site where we are enabling women entrepreneurs to come together under one platform and it's an e-commerce site where you you will be able to sell your products and women entrepreneurs from across maharashtra to begin with and god willing fingers crossed all across the country eventually will get a platform to showcase their products and sell their products across the country at a very very nominal commission charge you know you have a very long journey you have worked in marathi cinema hindi cinema and couple like lot of work you have done like how do you see your journey like what are the changes and the experience and everything i think to put it in one word i i i think my journey was um, enchanting i think that's that's the one word that i'd like to put my journey there were ups and downs there were highs and lows there were hits and misses there were some great performances and some not so great performances there were some uh, tv shows that i did which did very very well but i think overall it it's been a learning experience i've i've got to share my screen i've got the opportunity to work with some of the finest people in the country uh, so to speak when when sanjay bansali sir wanted to make a regional film outside of hindi cinema he chose to make a marathi film it was called lalishk and uh, he chose me as his hero so so getting to work with mr bansali is like a dream come true for any actor and getting to do it in my mother tongue was like the cherry on the cake so i think a lot of uh, i've been very blessed and uh, very very uh, 
I've been a part of some of some of the great uh, work that these people have done, and I've you know I've done my bit in in those films, and, and most of them have played the lead, and it's been an it's been an absolutely uh, roller coaster ride. It's been a lot of fun. Technology has changed, uh, cinema has changed a lot, TV has changed a lot, the stories have changed a lot, the approach, the audiences, their taste keeps changing. But I think what uh, doesn't uh, change or what has never changed for me is the hunger to do a little better work today and tomorrow than I did yesterday. Hmm. So lastly, what message would you like to give to our viewers? Uh, I, it'll be too preachy. I think everybody saying it's the last one year, but COVID is not over yet. Please, please stay safe. Wear your masks. Uh, absolutely, absolutely live your life and we're all kind of getting back to normal. But this is the new normal. So uh, I request everybody to you know basically sanitize yourself and maintain social distancing and everything that you've heard for the last one year. Uh, but क्या होता है कभी कभी बहुत सुन सुन के ना हम बोर हो जाते हैं and फिर उसकी अहमियत खत्म हो जाती है यार ये वही बोलते हैं यार कुछ नहीं होता. So I think this is the time when cases are rising again and this is the time when you know things are kind of going out of hand again. So uh, more than a message, it's a humble request to everybody to uh, take care of yourself, of your loved ones, of your family. and uh, please 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 take care of all the protocols and stay safe stay blessed thank you thank you brother